Victor G writes, hey guys, in 2006, I saw John's review of Clerks 2 on YouTube and have been following your work through the movie blog through to AMC. While I love the movie blog, I really am impressed what you've done with AMC over the last few years. That's because of the awesome people that I used to have working for me and now I have these guys. <laughs> My question is about the amazing <laughs> Spider-Man 2 with Electro, the Rhino, and Norman Osborn, possibly Green Go Goblin. It seems like they are packing a lot into the new film, which we know didn't work out so well in Spider-Man 3. Mm. Should we be worried they are not learning from past mistakes? No, I, I, honestly, I'm not worried about this anymore. Because remember, just because they have all these characters in it whose names you recognize, that doesn't necessarily mean they're all going to have big roles in it. Like, remember, any movie that you can think of has about 20 characters. It, they're not all significant characters. They're not all yeah. characters with names that you would recognize. But remember, you just know who this guy is in, in this universe. But just because they say have Paul Giamatti, who is playing the character that becomes Rhino or whatever, that doesn't necessarily mean Rhino is going to be a big character in this film or that Rhino is even going to appear. Like maybe they're just setting it up. He's there. He'll have a small role. And then in future films, they're setting something up. So I wouldn't worry about anything like that. Plus, lots of films have had multiple villains. Spider-Man 3 not being one of them. Lots of films have had multiple villains that have worked just fine. You know? So, I mean, because you could look at Star Wars. Oh, my gosh. This Star Wars movie is going to have Boba Fett and Darth Vader and the Emperor and yeah. all these bad guys. Well, guess what? It can work just fine if you do it right. Um, but I don't think Spider-Man's going to have, like, five big villains running amok all at the same time. That's just the way I see it. Jimmy? Yeah, I'm hoping. I'm I, I'm a little concerned myself just because I, I, it does seem like we're trying to pack so much into these films and, and, and go overboard. But I do agree with you. I mean, we you know, one villain could be in it for two scenes just hinted exactly, at. Exactly, yeah. So I think... Let's wait and see on that one because I do think it. I think I think it's going to be good. Yeah, I think the villain is going to be Electro. Yeah, and then we're going to be introduced and see a little bit of the other guys. I agree. I don't know that for a fact. But <laughs> no, that's, what, that's, I that's what I think too. That's what I think absolutely. Hey everyone, if you like this video, click that thumbs up button and make sure to subscribe to our AMC Movie News YouTube channel. It's free and helps you stay up to date with all the latest movie news as well as our daily AMC Movie Talk Show. Also, make sure that you follow us on Facebook and Twitter to stay up to date with all of our special promotions, contests, and prize giveaways.